tonight, I'm gonna show you how to make Keto Raffaellos. Stick around. Greetings, my confectionery compadres, and welcome to Randy Makes Candy, where I help you make tasty treats that people love to eat. Once again, I'm gonna try to recreate a commercially available candy here in the candy kitchen. Tonight's treat is based on a recipe sent to me by my brother, who's trying to reduce his carbohydrate intake. It's a keto version of the Raffaello candy from Ferraro, the same folks that make the Ferraro Rocher candy. This recipe is from the Family on Keto website, and I'll leave a link in the description. My favorite part of this recipe is the coconut. I am a total coconut stan. Who's with me? As always, I'd love to hear about your results if you decide to make your own Keto Raffaellos, as well as suggestions for other recipes you'd like to see in future videos. For this recipe, I'm using 10 sugar-free vanilla wafer cookies, some almonds, these are roasted, but you can use blanched or raw, it's up to you, one half cup of coconut flour, almond flour would work as well, one cup of unsweetened finely shredded coconut plus two tablespoons for coating, two thirds of a cup of mascarpone, one half cup of sweetener, I'm using erythritol, one half teaspoon of vanilla extract, and one half teaspoon of coconut extract. I also used a large bowl, a rolling pin, a spatula, a scoop, a cutting board, and some parchment. Okay, let's make some candy. Start out by crushing the cookies into crumbs. Don't take them all the way to powder because we want them to provide some crunch. Slice the almonds in half. In a large bowl, combine the almond meal, one cup of coconut, cookie crumbs, and sweetener. Add the mascarpone and vanilla and coconut extracts and mix to combine. Scoop some of the filling, add an almond half, and form it into a ball. Use some of the remaining coconut to coat the ball, then place it on a lined cutting board. Continue with the rest of the filling. Place the candies in the fridge for about half an hour to let them set. And that's it. Okay, let's have a taste. Slanchava. Like I said, I'm a big fan of coconut and this is just an amazing way to present it. It's smooth and creamy and crunchy, and the flavors all work so well together. It has a really delicate sweetness that's really nice, kind of sophisticated, if that makes any sense. If you're on keto but still want the Raffaello experience, you really ought to try these. Once again, I'm going to try to recreate a commercially available... Commercially? Tonight's treat is based on a recipe sent to me by... by, 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 by oh my goodness.